For those custom RAM that I've been flash in my Huawei Y60 device, it's not really for our device, it's really for Huawei P8 Lite. But it can be also in our device. So, um, there's a difference between Huawei P8 Lite and Huawei P8 Lite 2017. The difference is the Huawei P8 Lite, which is the latest version, it has an ARM uh, HI6210 SFT processor. While the uh, uh, Huawei P8 Lite 2017, it has an HI6250. So that's the difference between the two Huawei P8 Lite. So what's the point? The point is be careful flashing custom ROM. Faulty flashing may cost your software your device. By the way, this is Eli Vargitaurus. Welcome again to this another video. There's a lot of viewers asking me um, what are the best custom ROM for Huawei Y60 device or uh, what are the best custom ROM that you will recommend. All of the custom ROM that I've been flashed in my Huawei Y60 device, they all have their own bags and issues. Especially for the uh, uh, SIM card, those ROMs only work for LTSM. And that's the one. Secondly, the uh, very mode of their camera, all of them definitely not working fine. So, moreover than that, they all have their own bugs and issues. But don't worry, I give you a three best custom ROM, and this is only my, uh, based on my experience. And here's the three. The third of my choice is a paranoid Android. This Paranoid Android is a Nougat based Android version. It has a good sound quality. Even doesn't seem so different from its features but I can say that is a nice replacement if you want a Nougat version Android for your Huawei Y60 device. And second to the list is a Cult OS. It has also a smooth ROM with a Nougat based Android version. Having a lot of options that you can tweak the device itself. Having an omni switch to enable to navigate you into the last activity. And loving the cult OS of having a pie mode option. At the top of the list is a Maggie OS. Also having a smooth custom ROM which you can use into your device. Also having a nugget based under version. And for its bloatware, Maggie OS has an exposed installer but you need to root your device for you to able to use the exposed installer Mac EOS also has a one-handed mode to be used if you want to try one of them make sure to flash the custom kernel for your good battery consumption I put the link on the description below so you can check them out and of course the footage camera for you to able to capture the video into your device again this is Eliberty Tarus Thanks for watching, see you in the next video, God bless.